Engines of Sodor, Episode 3, Toad and the Express. Toad is a, is a great western toad brake van that escaped to Sodor with Oliver. He now works on the little western with Douglas and sometimes the main line with Douglas as well. He is a kind-natured brake van that works hard and tries his best. However, sometimes he can get ahead of himself. Like the time he told Oliver to pull, he influenced Oliver in pulling apart Scruffy. One day, Gordon chuffed into the state Tidmouth Station and stopped next to Rosie. Rosie, where's my brake coach? Oh, Gordon, the brakes on it have broken. We don't have a co brake coach. The brake needs to be taken to the works. Well, I can't have a train without a brake coach. Shunt it on the back of my train. Let's see. This will never do. Just then, Doug... Just then, Douglas pulled in with a goods train from the Little West. From the Little Western. Ah, Toad! Uh, yes, Mr. Yes, Mr. Gordon. Said Toad. Would you like to bring a temporary break coach for the day? Oh, well, I'd love to, Mr. Are, are you sure, Mr. Gordon? Yes, my break coach is on the train, but the brakes need repairing. Would you mind doing it? Well, if there's no other option available... I suppose I have. I suppose I'll have to, Mr. Gordon. Good sir, old chap. Mr. Gordon. He soon cleared the way for Rosie to move so Gordon could back down on his express. Back down onto the train, then moved it to platform two. Where Douglas maneuvered him, his goods train and coupled Toad to the rear of the train. I'm ready when you are, Mr. Gordon. Right -o, Toad. Soon the guard's whistle blew, and slowly but surely the the, tr the unusual train took off. They rocketed through Coven's Gate, surprising all the narrow gauge engines there. Soon they arrived at Vickerstown where Miss Hat was waiting. I say, Toad, fantastic job today. Well, Miss Hat, my ears, my wheels do wake a bit, but. I'm glad that I could have been of serv that I I'm glad that I could have been of service to my railway. Well, you've certainly done that. You're in you're deserving of a rest. Patrick helps 
break Gordon's train for the rest of the way, and later they came on the way back. Patrick returned with the express. As he had automatic braking system, which he could, his brakes would break the whole train. Soon, Oliver arrived to collect Toad. Oh, hello, Mr. Oliver. Hello, Toad. Douglas offered, asked me if I could bring you back to the Little West. Toad began to tell Oliver all about his trip with the Express. Well, Toad, you've had a very eventful day, haven't you? Oh, yes, Mr. Oliver. It was amazing. I've never moved. My wheels have never worked so quickly in my life. <laughs> I don't doubt that, Toad. Well, I'm off to the sheds now. Goodbye. He whistled. And chopped off. That evening, Rosie sidled alongside Toad. Well, Toad, did you like your day out? Oh, yes, Mrs. Rosie. Although, I don't think I'd want to go again. Why was that? My wheels ache. Soon the two engine, the, the engine and brake van were laugh, laughing. I don't think Toad will be back on the back of the express anytime soon. Don't you? 